Rahman Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Mohammad Asim. I am working as a DevOps engineer. In this video, I am going to cover the GitHub Actions. Along with that, I am going to cover the AWS Code Deploy Service. And we are going to use the AWS Code Pipeline. And uh, along with that, we are going to uh, deploy our application in the EC2 instance. And um, our application build is going to be through the github actions and we are going to dockerize our applications so if your application is uh, not dockerized uh, this video is also for you if you don't want to dockerize uh, the architecture is going to be same the concept is going to be same so uh, this video or this series of videos uh, I request you to uh, please watch all these videos till end so your concepts with regard to the automated deployment with regard to the versioning of your application and uh, CI CD is going to be really easy uh, if you watch all the videos in the series so let's begin so for the ease of use what I have done that I've created a repository this is the public repository and um, the application I'm going to um, deploy on AWS is going to be in this folder and we are going to use the GitHub Actions for that. So uh, let me give you a little detail about uh, this application. So what you have to do is to simply uh, download this zip on your local desktop machine. So I already have done it. So, uh, what I'm going to do is to just uh, show you the access keys and secret access key. So I have the privileges uh, to create all this stuff on AWS. So let me do AWS configure. So the reason I'm doing this uh, that I'm going to use the Terraform for the deployment of EC2 instance. On that particular EC2 instance, I'm going to deploy our application. So um, it has a lot of steps which I will show you definitely. So um, let me show you all the stuff as well. So um, what I've done that um, I have downloaded, already downloaded this particular repository on my local desktop machine. You can download the zip as well. So I'm going to open the BS code and show you the code, uh, what we are going to cover. So also let me show you guys that um, if you navigate to the VPC section uh, in the first uh, part of uh, this series of videos, uh, automated uh, CI/CD code, uh, you know, deployment. So what I'm going to do is to deploy a custom VPC, and in that particular uh, VPC, I'm going to launch one EC2 instance through the Terraform. So as I told you that I've already downloaded this. Uh, all stuff on my local desktop so i'm going to drag uh, this directory on my vs code so let me show you the stuff with regard to the terraform so this is our main tf file so as i told you that i'm going to use the custom vpc and in that particular custom vpc we are going to uh, launch one ec2 instance and i'm going to later on take the ami of this and uh, with regard to that particular EC2 instance, I need to show you that uh, I'm going to use the user data and in that particular user data, I'm going to uh, install the code deploy agent. So you have to simply copy paste uh, this stuff with regard to that. Also, I am installing the Docker. So uh, if you're using the Terraform code, that, that would be fine. So let me show you what uh, what I mean by that. So let's begin. So as I already configured my access keys and secret access key, what I'm going to do is to navigate into that particular uh, directory, okay? Simply drag it down, okay? CD into this particular directory. And I'm going to navigate to VPC. Let me zoom in a bit for you guys. And so it would be really easier for you to see all the stuff. 
as uh, you know guys i made my videos hands on so uh, it is just not uh, you know complete theory if you see my videos still and you will be able to understand that uh, the code is there how i apply the code how you can use uh, this code in your production or dev environment so your concepts are going to be really clear so uh, what i've done here i've um, uh, apply the terraform init command so it is uh, it is going to download the relevant modules on your uh, machine so uh, i already installed the terraform cli on my windows machine so what it is going to do is to uh, is actually downloading uh, currently it is downloading the uh, modules and then i'm going to uh, use the terraform apply command and we are going to uh, launch one ec2 instance so guys uh, this part is uh, definitely is going to be finished uh, till the deployment of ec2 instance we are going to take the ami uh, and then in the next uh, video i will cover the relevant steps uh, definitely i'm going to show you these steps as well which we are going to cover so uh, this is the repository and these are the steps i've already provided you the steps so uh, this video is uh, relevant to the ci cd process as i told you and uh, this uh, video is different in a way that we are going to cover the deployment automated deployment of your application on ec2 instance rather than the ecs or fargate and we are going to use the docker container for the deployment and everything is going to be automated so what you have to do is to follow these steps as i told you that um, all these steps are going to be uh, part of my later videos so i'm going to definitely cover these so uh, currently what we are doing that uh, let me show you that ec2 part and the vpc stuff as well in this uh, part so uh, you should be able to understand that we are currently deploying the custom vpc in our environment along with that we are going to launch one ec2 instance so it is going to be really quick as it is going to uh, launch uh, private public subnets along with uh, you know igw internet gateway and NAT gateway so you see it is almost uh, initializing up and running so uh, in that particular ec2 instance i'm going to show you that uh, installation of docker is there so let me uh, ssh into that so you can also ssh into that particular ec2 instance because i've already uh, provided you the keys for that as well so simply navigate to the module section and navigate to secrets and copy this private file okay so we are almost done with the first part just i have to show you this stuff that uh, we have deployed the custom VPC along with the EC2 instance and how our application is going to be, you know, installed in that everything is going to be from, uh, you know, from scratch, I will show you. So definitely it is not a CD, it is SSH hyphen I and I'm going to SSH into this particular machine c2 dash user okay so i have to copy the ip address of that particular machine so let me copy that and so as far as the security groups are concerned port 80 and port 22 is uh, allowed uh, for uh, everyone so let me ssh into this particular machine okay we are now into the in the machine and let me show you the system ctl status of docker so you see guys uh, our installation of docker is automated so i'm going to take the custom ami of this particular machine so why i'm doing that that would be part of uh, of our next video so i'm going to call this cloud geeks cloud geeks c 
ca dash f so i'm going to create this app and you know this ama will take about uh, four to five minutes so i will cover my next video from uh, the same point where i left so if you like the video please like share and subscribe my channel and um, please share as much as you can have a nice day thank you very much